It is possible that Prince Harry's February 6 travel to Britain was for his own benefit, rather than only to see an ailing King Charles III. Harry would have known he had this interview in the US, and would be asked about his father, so he needed material, a source at the palace said. The palace was not stupid, and knew they had to limit the time he could spend with the king. Expert on royal family matters Angela Levin even went as far as to say that the fiery-haired prince whizzed over the idea of praising himself in the interview by bringing up his dad's bad sickness. Before describing his appearance with Good Morning America on Friday, February 16, as shameless and despicable, the author continued, it's all totally insincere, and to give him publicity. During the short Q&A, the Duke of Sussex chose not to reveal the outlook regarding Charles III's health, but he added, I've got other trips planned that would take me through the UK or back to the UK, so I'll stop in and see my family as much as I can. By saying, listen, I love my family, the royal rebel committed a serious breach of Buckingham Palace protocol that forbids disclosing discussions regarding the royal health. Thank goodness I could board a plane and go see him. I treasure the time I got to spend with him. The power of the family unit coming together is something I witness every day in all these households. I believe that sickness, in general, has a way of uniting families. Prince William, who reportedly avoided his younger brother at the 45-minute reunion between the King and Harry on February 6, went unmentioned. The public had high hopes that Harry's recent visit would bring the two once very close royal siblings back together, but alas, it did not happen. The scandals involving the Sussexes had caused them to avoid communicating for months. Brother William is not someone William trusts. The reason behind this is crystal clear, according to royal historian Richard Fitzwilliams, who spoke exclusively to the Royal Observer after reading his disastrous memoir Spare. We are aware that there is a significant divide within the royal family, he continued. We also know that Harry's visit, after he learned of his father's illness, was brief, and the pair spent only some 30 minutes together. This might have been due to the king's exhaustion from recently starting outpatient treatment, Fitzwilliam stated. William, who had two royal obligations the following day and was tending to his wife's recovery and children, was too busy for him to visit. And that's it for our video. I will like to see what you think in the comments. Thanks and see you in the next.